Yo, yo, man. How you doing, man? Anyway, <laughs> I'm in a funny mood. Um, it's two minutes to midnight here, and uh, I'm thinking of the Iron Maiden song. Two minutes to midnight. I really need to go to bed, I think, soon. But before I do, I'm doing episode two of Randomizer. Um, <laughs> I hope you find this funny. Uh, if not, fuck you, man. Um, <laughs> okay, so let's kick this bad boy off. Cotton, okay? Uh, cotton, my first thought was T-shirt. T-shirts. Uh, they're very important and very key. And cotton fields, that's what I was thinking of. Um, but I'm, I'm not an expert in cotton, I'm afraid, so moving on. Alligators. Alligators. That reminds me of a movie, a B-movie that I watched when I was very little that made an impact on me. It was called Alligator. It was about a, um, I think it was a little girl. It was a long time since I saw it, but she won a prize, little alligator at some kind of... Um, I don't know, it was an event in America somewhere and her parents don't like it and they flush it down the toilet and there's like radiation in the sewer and the the alligator grows to like insane size and starts going around and um, eating everyone. So it's kind of like a rip-off of Jaws, but I thought it worked pretty well. Um, thirdly... Uh, soccer. Now I'm actually the worst person on soccer because I'm not, I'm not a football fan, uh, not a not a, a British soccer fan. So I really don't have much insight there. I I was when I was um, a teenager though. I was an Arsenal fan because my friend at school was was an Arsenal fan. So I kind of like tried to be as well, and I played in goal. So I got an Arsenal goalie top. But I've never even been to see a football match, so I'm not normal like that. Um, fourthly, pigeons. Pigeons just crap on everything, and they're really quite annoying. Um, when I had the flat in London, we had these um, things on the... You, ne you needed to put spikes on the um, pipes and things, stop them landing, because they make such a mess. So I'm not a pigeon fan, you may have gathered. Um... Nurses. Nurses are really amazing and they do they do amazing work and um, we should all be very grateful for nurses. Um, most of the time they're really really great people and they care for people who are sick and here we have the, for now we have the NHS which is really really great and it upsets me to think that this may be going. Um, the idea of having health care for everyone is such a good one. I really do value the NHS. My, my aunt's a nurse and they do such incredible, incredible work. So, um, yeah, I, I do think they're amazing people. Um, Socialism. Socialism. Hmm. I. Sorry, I'm just gonna see what's going on here with. Okay, so some aspects of socialism, I believe, are quite good. Um, they do. Uh, like the idea of it is is quite good in a, in a way in certain ways but it doesn't it doesn't work um because people you know it's like that animal farm where it's like um where the the pigs you know they say that all animals you know all animals are equal but some are more equal than others and you just see that in in the socialist countries where people are still abusing the system and you know people at the top are creaming it off and um just corrupt so you know the, the system in itself it it doesn't it doesn't work um 
it's it's nice in theory and and like some of those things like some of the ideas like healthcare for everyone and um you know that that's great but overall it it doesn't really work and um the last one is x-rays uh, x-rays i had quite a few i had x-rays um on my teeth a lot you know in the dentists so yeah i've been zapped with rays quite a few times so that's episode two of randomizer please do share like subscribe if you got anything out of this video cheers